Hey there, it's Jake. Ever wondered how to fix a blacklisted IMEI or a bad ESN on your phone? Maybe you've been tempted to try some sketchy service or software you found online. Well, I'm here to tell you there's a much better, safer, and quicker way to get your device back in action, completely free. In this video, I'll walk you through an A to Z guide on repairing IMEI issues for both iOS and Android devices. Stick around, you don't wanna miss this. Remember, this info is for responsible use only. It's for people who own their device, but forgot their access info. We don't support illegal actions like bypassing security on stolen devices. Respect the law and others' rights. This video follows YouTube's guidelines and community standards. With that said, let's continue. All right, so let's talk about the options you've got when it comes to removing the blacklist from an IMEI. Now, there's a bunch of services out there, but I gotta tell you, they're not all created equal. First up, we've got Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. It's super innovative and designed to handle the tricky stuff for you. No tech speak or confusing steps, just straightforward user-friendly directions to get you back on track. Then there's Safe Unlocks. These guys are all about security, as you can guess from the name. They've got a reliable system that's helped countless people regain access to their devices without any risks. Last but not least, we've got ESN Doctor. They're definitely worth mentioning. They're right up there with the best of them when it comes to removing IMEI blacklists, and they've got a solid reputation to back it up. Remember, I'm just sharing this for educational purposes and to help out those who are facing this issue. We're not endorsing any specific service over others. It's always best to do your own research to find what works best for you. Moving on, we're going to show you how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. Trust me, you're gonna love this, so stay tuned. This is worth noting though. The unlock services are primarily effective in first world countries, but if you're unable to access them or would rather not use them, don't worry. We're giving away 250 unlocks every week to our loyal viewers. Here's the catch. If you want to join in on this deal, the process is quite straightforward. Simply hit the like button on this video, subscribe to our channel, and leave a comment below. In your comment, mention the model of your device, for example, a Samsung S9, your IMEI, and the country you're from. The moment you complete these steps, you're automatically thrown into the mix. So don't delay and stand a chance to be among our weekly winners. Best of luck. First, open up your choice of browser, either on your phone or computer, and type in unlockhere.com. This takes you to the official AI unlocking website for removing the IMEI blacklist. You'll meet Nifty, an AI tool by Unlock Here. Just scroll down a bit and pick the option that fits your needs. For this, we're going with Fix IMEI Blacklist. From here, simply follow the steps on the app. Start by choosing your device's brand. The app supports all major and medium-sized brands. Select yours and hit the Next button. The app will now ask for your device's IMEI or serial number. If you're not sure how to find this, there's a tutorial right there in the app. But basically, you'll need to open your phone's dialer and press asterisk number sign 06 number sign. This will pop up a window with your device's info, including the IMEI number. To wrap up your request, you'll need to provide your name and email address. Make sure you agree with the terms and conditions of the app. If anything's unclear, feel free to look at the resources provided. Once you've successfully submitted your application, an email with your unlock details will be sent your way. It usually takes about five to 15 minutes, so be patient and remember to check your spam or promotions folder. Once you get the email, it's time to confirm your order. Copy the verification code from the email, then click on confirm my order. Paste your code on the next page, fill out the CAPTCHA, and finish off by clicking Validate Info and Start Unlock. And that's it, you're done. Nifty will take over and wrap up the unlocking process. Just pop in a compatible SIM card and restart your device. As demonstrated, the IMEI unlock method proves to be highly effective, not only for the Samsung S9, but also for a wide range of devices. You can go ahead and give it a try with confidence, and feel free to inspect your device to ensure everything is running smoothly. If anything trips you up along the way, don't hesitate to chat with live support. They're ready and waiting to help you out. All right, folks, let's dive into some other alternative methods to remove carrier blacklists. Now, this information is pretty hard to come by as, quite frankly, not a lot of people are talking about it. So let's address some of these underexplored yet totally legal options. First off, you could actually contact your carrier directly. This is the most straightforward route. If your account is in good standing and you've fulfilled all your contract requirements, most carriers will unlock your device for you. 
It's worth noting though, this isn't always a surefire method, especially if your carrier is being difficult. Another option is to use an unlocking company. Now be careful here, not all unlocking companies are created equal. Try to avoid those too good to be true deals as they often are. Instead, look for reputable companies with solid reviews and transparent practices. Lastly, keep in mind that using these methods doesn't guarantee success every time. Different carriers and phones might require different approaches. Always remember, we're dealing with technology here, and there can be exceptions to every rule. That's all for today, folks. See you in the next video.